This is a construction update provided by the City of Somerville and read by Somerville Media Center. Beacon Street Reconstruction. During the week of August 19th, contractors plan to install granite edging for the northbound raised cycle track on Beacon Street between Kent Street and Oxford Street. Installation of street furniture is also expected to begin along the roadway. Logistics for the next round of paving are being finalized. If you live in the area, please make sure you're signed up for the city's alert system to be notified in advance. Cyclists are advised to continue using the bike tour, the bike detour during construction. Green Line Extension. Overnight work is planned in Medford at Granville Ave near Ball Square late Friday into Saturday morning, August 16th through 17th at approximately 1 a.m. through 6 a.m. Crews plan to install track matting, which will allow future truck traffic to cross over the tracks without damaging them. This is not typically a very noisy operation, but backup alarms may be audible in the area. Those are legally mandated and can't be turned off. New lights will also be used in an effort to reduce the amount of light escaping the site. Overnight work is also planned starting Sunday, August 18th throughout the week within the rail corridor between School Street and Central Street. Anticipated work hours are 9 p.m. to 6 a.m. Here, crews will install new storm drain lines and utilities. Heavy equipment will be in motion throughout the night and may be loud at times. If you need assistance for a GLX construction-related matter, please call the 24-7 GLX hotline at 1-855-GLX-INFO or email info at glxinfo.com. Sacramento Street Underpass Rehabilitation During the week of August 19th and over the course of an estimated three weeks, crews plan to place concrete for new stairs and ramps. Once the concrete cures, field measurements will be taken for new railings. The underpass will remain closed until later this fall. Somerville Ave Utility and Streetscape Improvements As a reminder, weekdays between about 6.30 a.m. and 4 p.m. eastbound traffic on Somerville Ave will be directed right onto Webster Ave, left onto Prospect Street, straight onto Washington Street, and then right onto Medford Street. For MBTA bus riders, in addition to the already closed Somerville Ave at Prospect Street stop, the Somerville Ave at Linden stop, and the Somerville Ave opposite Mansfield stop on Route 87 inbound are closed for the duration of this diversion. Temporary service will be offered at other bus stops nearby on Prospect Street and Washington Street. Please see the MBTA website for service advisories or the Detours tab of the project website for maps and more information. This detour is estimated to be in place through approximately October 2019. It will enable contractors to continue installing the box culvert drainage infrastructure between Miriam Street and Prospect Street. Between Prospect Street and Stone Ave, crews continue utility work, backfilling, and working towards restoring that stretch of the roadway. Somerville High School Building Project. If weather permits, contractors plan to place concrete floor slabs for the second level of the Western Wing early Monday, August 19th. Trucks will arrive starting at 3 a.m. This process is expected to repeat two more times in the coming weeks to place the third and fourth floors. If you live near the high school, please ensure you're enrolled in the city's alert system to be notified in advance. Now that Phase 2 work zone has been established further east, take a look at the latest site logistics plan which shows the campus layout through fall 2020. Washington Street Water Main Upgrades During the week of August 19th, contractors plan to continue transferring individual water services over to the temporary water main. When those transfers are complete, work to begin cleaning and lining or replacing portions of the permanent water main on Washington Street between Line Street and Hawkins Street will begin. Some residents will experience interruptions to their water service during construction. Sign up for the city's alert system to ensure you're notified in advance. Pavement and Sidewalk Management Program, Powderhouse Boulevard. Rescheduled, weather permitting crosswalks and stop bars on Powderhouse Boulevard at Alewife Brook Parkway to Powderhouse Square will now be installed overnight, starting Sunday, August 18th, over the course of an estimated three to four nights. Work hours are approximately 8 p.m. to 5 a.m. 
This new schedule is an effort to minimize traffic disruptions and expedite installation. Minimal noise is expected. Alternating two-way traffic is expected to be maintained during installation, but on-site police details may close the road for safety reasons. Sidewalk reconstruction. Medford Street, Partridge Ave to School Street. Additional utility work. Utility companies are responsible for notifying residents prior to conducting any work, but we expect parking restrictions and lane shifts due to the following utility work. Detail officers may close a road if deemed necessary for safety. West Branch Library Renovation. College Ave, Park Ave to Chapel Street. Utility installation planned through August. Two-way traffic is expected to be maintained. And Eversource Gas will be working at Alston Street, Cherry Street, Dearborn Road, Laurel Terrace, Pearson Road, Prescott Street, and Spring Hill Terrace. And National Grid will be working on Washington Street, Crescent Street to Franklin Street. Finally, keep an eye out for changes coming soon to Central Broadway as part of the Winter Hill in Motion initiative. From Magoon and McGrath, new pavement markings, new signage, and re-time traffic signals are on the way. This has been a construction update provided by the City of Somerville and read to you by Somerville Media Center. For more information, visit the city's construction website at somervillema.gov where you can sign up for these weekly updates.